Hey guys and welcome back. So last episode we basically had this vision. We went into um this person's temple. Wait, if I go to my handbook. Not handbook. Skills? Uh loot rucksack. Oh well, basically, uh we went to this person's temple and she told us to look for an item and then we had this like epiphany, I guess. And uh now what are we doing? We are investigating Bad Town. And Bad Town is over here. Let me just look at how far away it is. Uh, yeah, that's going to be cutworthy. In fact, on my way, I'm going to... I don't know how to tell if the... Radio, I think I've done... Yeah, I've done this radio tower. Um, I'm going to do as many radio towers as I can on the way. And this would be a cut as opposed to a time lapse. Because last time... Um, it really threw me off. There's a car there, that's convenient. It really threw me off the timings. So, um, yeah, this will be a cut. Um, I'll be back in a bit. Should have taken a few of these radio towers and I should be in Bad Town. All right, so after realizing that you can fast travel there, I'm now at Bad Town. My objective is just over here. So I was thinking, it's a lick. A lit. Low income town. Oh yeah, where the guy. There was smoke. He brought us in. Chances are no other town. In the world lives up to its name better than bad town. Okay. I don't know why I'd be here, but sure. You hear about Snow White? Shut up about Snow White. Every time you tell the story, we're playing. What the hell are you talking about? Snow White escapes from Foster's prison camp. Next thing you know, he's killing guys with a machine. Oh, that's the worst vision of the story I ever heard. You ruined the drama. Sounds like Hoyt needs to step in. Yeah, if that's true. <laughs> He'll even make quick work of the guy, that's for sure. He'll probably kill him with his own machete. He already did with the owner of the mine. Hoyt's an artist. He'll kill this one, Bishop. Am I right? What'd you say he looked like again? All in. play. That's the guy. Play a game of poker. Oh, that's ticked off. I was about to say that's a interesting objective. Without getting noticed. I don't know how loosely we have to follow, but I don't know who the man in white is. All oh, right, there he is. So sneak around, I guess. Um, yeah. See where he goes. I didn't actually take any of the ready tiles because I realised that you could just that I wasn't going to see them on the way here because I could just fast travel. I feel like sneaking is gonna make everything better. Did he spot me? No. No, we're good. So basically when you get too far away it'll give you the time and when you get too close it'll ask if he spotted you. Or he'll ask himself. Is this a lit nightclub? Guy's got some interesting interests. I'm just gonna take some cover whenever I can without knocking things over. What's this woman saying? It's pretty concerning. 
Oh, that's gonna go into him. <laughs> I was hoping it would knock him over. I wonder how long we have to follow this guy for. It's getting kind of tedious. Get back. Okay. I'm really enjoying this game. I love the map and stuff. It's really nice. Like GTA is all urban and everything. Are you serious? That failed. There's not much cover in this area, so I'm just gonna stay down here and hope for the best. Hope that he doesn't turn around like he normally does randomly. Must be nearly there, surely. Just watch you down here. Pretty tedious mission, but they have to be done. This must be it. All oh, right, there he is. Just gonna enter this building. Is that it? Just had to follow that guy. Okay. Enter the shack and confront the stranger. Okay. Patriot doesn't just put his hand on his heart while holding a hot dog at the ball game. That's a gosh darn cakewalk, pardon my French. The real Patriot suckles at the teat of Lady Liberty. Upon hearing of the death of a brother at war, the real Patriot asks, did we win? And then rejoices at the pronouncement of victory. So, are you a real Patriot or one of those Walt Whitman hippies who cries when the jean store runs out of pocket squares? A real Patriot. Bingo. That's what I like to hear. By the way, Voss has your friend Oliver Carswell, and I'm zeroing in on Keith Ramsey. Why are you looking for them? It's my job to know this island inside and out. I can help you, but you gotta play the game. There's something I'm looking for. We'll trade favors. Deal. Okay. So by confronting him, it meant he'll confront me. Jason. What are you? Some kind of spy? I'm not gonna confirm or deny that. Just messing with you. I work for Langley, Agent Willis Huntley. Oh, great. I need to get help from the Army and the government. You can't. I'm embedded, not really in contact with Central Intelligence. <laughs> so, you're alone here? No. Are you kidding? I got a whole team. They're out in the field, but they'll be back. These scans they sent have opened up a grade A can of worms. I can't talk to you about it, but trust me, it's big. Sounds huge. I need more info, though, from the source. Flammenwerfer. <laughs> Flamethrower. This beauty was invented in Krautland. The... Uh... Hoyt Volker is the boss of a very good friend of yours, Voss. He also happens to run the largest slave trading ring in the South Pacific. On top of that, he grows drugs. If we set fire to his fields and his boat, he's gonna canoe over to this island. I get what I want, and we learn more about your friends. Capiche? I feel like that's only an Italian thing. Only Italians can say that. It's like spraying furniture gold. You know what I mean? Anyway, here's the gun. Wow. Thanks. That's what I like to hear. Don't forget the boat. Yeah, I got it. I'm trusting you on this thing with Hoyt. You guys heard of the flamethrowers that are going around YouTube right now? People are like buying them off this website for like $500 I think it is. And it's, if you want it in the UK, it's like $100 shipping. It's pretty insane. I've heard of so many big YouTubers that are buying them. Although I do think that would be count as an illegal weapon. Craft a simple holster. Sure thing, how do we craft? Syringe holster, there it is. 
do we need? Goat skin. Okay. Well, we'll figure that out at another point. Our flamethrower. No one on Rock Island really knows how a batch of World War Two era flamethrowers from Russia arrived on their shores. Use them now before they disappear into the mist. Oh, well, indeed. Um, I'm not actually sure what I'm meant to be doing. Do you think I could use this in public? No. All right. We're calling Dennis. Hey, Dennis? What did you find? The vision led me to the man in white. Turns out he's a spy or something. Funny. I've never heard of such a man here on the island. Yeah, he told me about Voss's boss, Hoyt. Hoyt Volka. Stay away from him, Jason. You think Voss is crazy? All the evil on the island it comes from Hoyt. He took Voss's mind away from him. It is he who pulls the strings. Wow. Okay, I'll be careful. Kick the hornet's nest. Let's go. Could probably get this done in this episode. Reach the drug fields. Is there any quick travel? Nope. So, as usual, I'm going to meet you guys when we're there. Okay, I'm here. Looks like we're burning the drug crops. I love this music. Oh, okay. This is interesting. I hope we don't get... Yeah, there are authorities that can stop us. That's fine. What are they going to do when I've got my flame flow? Flame flow. Alright, looks like it wants me to get this one first. No, it just disappears when I go towards it. Oh. Did he just punch me? Oh, I... But myself. I was about to say, what gave me that much damage? Alright, so now we can see the plants are, but when we get close, it goes away. Sent that whole place on fire. I think we should just burn the, all of the crops. It's probably the best idea. I keep setting myself on fire on accident. I love this though. We're just rocking up with a flamethrower. It looks like it's setting everything on fire right now. So if we go over here. Do something like that. Oh, I don't know. It damaged me that bad. That's just one. Is that it? One? I've basically burnt the whole place down. Um. Sorry, what is this music? Okay, where are the rest of them then? If that's only one of them done. Yeah, I really think we should have um, brought a weapon. I think that's what they were hinting at when they said, when they were telling me how to holster weapons. It's fine. Set that on fly fire and run. Let them have fun. What's going on down here? Okay, I'm gonna go through this way. This is so sick. Did that get him? Yeah, it did. Look how many people there are. This is uh, not good. Oh, it's using water now. Yeah, that's not good, is it? We're dead. We're kind of stuck, aren't we? Because we're out of ammo on this thing. Okay. Um, Alright, I'm going to have to restart the mission. Okay, so what I've done, guys, is I've come all the way down here and basically taken this radio tower because it was the only area I could find. Uh, in fact, it might not have been this one. It might have been this one. Um, yeah, I couldn't find any areas with goats in them and you need the goat hide or something for the, uh, the holster. And I couldn't find... Look, in all these areas, there's no goats. So I had to do a bit of exploring just to find an area with a goat in so I could get the holster. 
Um, and here we are. I think I'm gonna now buy another gun. My FPS has dropped for some sudden reason. Okay. I don't know what to get. Um, I've got a lot of free ones because I've activated a few um, radio towers. I've only got $689. To be fair, I don't know if that's good or bad. Let's look at the price of that. The AK. It says we've got. Uh, oh, yeah, equip. I was about to say, I don't know where it is. But apparently, we've got it. I'll put it there. Our frame for uh, is currently there. So, we've got that. Can we fill up on ammo? Refill inventory. Sort of rifle rounds, flame for a fuel is expensive. Uh, yeah, let's do that. And we've got a 20% discount. Nice. Okay, so let's accept this. Oh, I meant to say, like, accept what I've bought and go out of it. Okay, so we've got some information about that. So now, how do we go from our... Is it just switching, like, one and two? Nice. And I think we've got two Molotovs and grenades as well. Yeah, look. Because when you use the middle mouse button. So I think we're now ready to hit up that drug field. Okay, so I think it would be a bit unfair to blame it entirely uh, on the fact that we had this flamethrower. But it is so hard to kill people with a flamethrower. You don't know, man, because it's melee. So you basically have to go up to everyone individually. Uh, whereas here, we can snipe from distance, which is nice. A lot easier. Uh, in fact, we might even just be able to take everyone out and then head in to burn the crops. If that makes any sense. Um... It might have just been the two on this small area, but I do acknowledge that it does become a lot heavier. Uh, there's a dog by the sounds of it. Okay, I've got the flamethrower. Let's burn this. That should spread. That's why I've not done many, really. So... This should spread and work. If it doesn't... I don't know if it will spread to the one to the left. Might have to go do that as well. Because there's this sort of gap in the middle. Oh, it looks like it is. There it is. We've got people looking, apparently. That's fine, because I've got my AK. Alright, let's let that burn. Next location. It should tell us when we've finished it. Oh, we've been seen for sure. By who? Oh, it's a dog, I think. Yeah, I can see it. Probably better staying somewhere a bit more open so we can see where everyone is. Where this dog is. Oh, there it is. I think we've killed it. Okay, find the next drug crops. So it does take a while, but um, as opposed to just going straight and burning it all, I think I'm going to burn a little bit. And then wait for it to spread because we really need to preserve ammo wherever we can. Because we don't have much. That's in terms of flamethrower ammo. And okay. I don't know. We're going to go jump right into that. That's all good. I've got my AK. I'm happy to fight you guys. The dogs, however, are actually kind of annoying. I just closed OBS. No. Okay. Yeah, dogs are actually annoying though. So that's different. Yeah, this is so much easier. With this holster now. Um, so yeah, I think the technique, I'm just going to keep rinse and repeat for each area. I don't know how many areas there are. Uh, I'm just going to kill everyone from a distance. And then head in and burn the crops. Because there's no point uh, going in and just getting killed. So I have to get this guy. Are we out of ammo? No. Are we actually... Okay. Might get away with this one. But that's not good. Are we going to have to head back? I don't know if it, I think it might cancel if I head back. I think I've got... I've got frame throws. Throw them into there. Oh, yeah. That's cool. Um, and there's more over there. Can we throw it really far? No, not by the looks of it, but that'll speed up. Oh, or it'll do that. Sure. So it's pretty sick. Um, it's pretty annoying, however, with the fact that I've lost the ammo for my AK. So I think I'm going to go back. Um, I don't, because I've had so many recordings at this point, I don't know um, how long we actually are into the total video, like the edited video. Um, 
so I'm just gonna have to end the video here. Um, it can't be too long, can't be too short. It will be somewhere. So, yeah, this music is ridiculous. I'm gonna see you guys in my next video where we're just gonna continue this mission.